runs on what? The, the, the hydrogen hybrid is what it's so. Uh, it runs with water. Yes, it runs with water. Man, that is so green. Would I you mean, like a demonstration? You, you're, you mean you can actually demonstrate it? Yes. Of course, that would be great. Inside of this baby, and uh, what's happening inside? Of it? Look at those two. It looks like two jars. These are two fuel cells. Look at those. These are fuel fuel cells. They take water, H2O, split it into the basic uh, components: two parts hydrogen, one part oxygen, and then that's introduced into the combustion chamber. And that's what gives you all the gains. Yeah. With this one, I've gained about 35. And it's quiet too. It makes the motor run smoother and quieter. What it does, Dave and Kristen. Now, what do you think about all that there? So we're producing hydrogen. They're produ look. It's producing hydrogen down in there. Look at the bubbles. How much does it, all this cost? It, it would just go well, for a setup like this is about a thousand dollars installed. Hey, a thousand bucks. And but, but you're going to save that in just a and month. And there's a tax credit for it too. All right, so Dave and Kristen, let's get this straight. It costs you a thousand bucks, okay? I mean, uh, that's just a, f a few, couple of months or so, or three months at gas prices the way they are. Plus, you get a tax credit, so it's, it ends up being less than a thousand. Yes. So it could cover the entire cost. Cost about man, it doesn't get any better than that. Now let me show you how this works. Let me show you how to fill it. Alex, we're going to find out how to fill it when we come back. Is that all right, my friend? Because we're out of time. But because I'm the weatherman for KUSI, I want to get. I, I'd love to. Sir, excellent. Pay and get it done. We have all different types of styles too. So we can put this into the trunk and do uh, installation in the trunk and run run the the lines right over. The pliers are here. Give them a DVD too. That's I should be doing that. Yes. Right. Give them a DVD and give them some pliers. Yeah. There's a plier. Isn't that awesome? Yeah. Do you have you had That's this? That's why I'm here. Yeah, actually, I've got a um, something that we find from nature, and it's water. called water. This is water. And hydrogen is the most abundant substance in the universe. Alex, this is something else. This is our fuel cell. Yeah, let's show David where it is. Is it down here? It looks like a thermos. Very similar. <laughs> I guess you could have some coffee in the morning too. <laughs> okay, it's right here, right? And you do, you you put this on on your you take a regular Harley like the kind David has, yeah. And you stick this little gizmo on the front of it, and that makes it a hydrogen hybrid. And how much can you save? What's the gap? The Most of the average that we're getting is somewhere between twenty to fifty percent. It depends on each vehicle. Not as much as eighty-six percent, as little as ten. So it pays for it. Now, how much did, if, he, if Dave wanted to convert his car and become eco friendly, say, even more so than he already is, how much would it cost to do this to his Harley? About seven, eight hundred dollars. Okay, but you get a tax credit? Yes. All right, and how much is that, Alex? The, the same type of tax credit. You're still in the, the, so low, the, it lowest, saves the lowest tax credit. Does he have to fill out some forms here? Yes. The deal, Dave. Yes, there's a tax credit form. We have an, uh, an owner's manual that gives you all the forms, all the instructions, and everything with it that you make the purchase. So it pays for itself right up front, and then boom, you're saving. That's correct. Plus you're saving. Immediately, too. right after you do an installation, you'll feel like you're power. I have people <laughs> coming back to me all the time saying, this thing runs the way I used to, uh, when I first bought it 10 years ago. Does it still have that little Harley rumble? What, what is that, Dave? It's, that's a, it's a little more throaty. Really? Yeah. yeah. A little more throaty, and Can you myself, it? myself, um... The clutch I'm having to pull in when I'm when I'm going into turns because it's too sensitive. Can you get it? Can you start it up for us? Um, is it a, uh, I, pull oils, it? I, no, I pull the oils. I know I pull the oils and gas when I went up to Sacramento. They told me that I couldn't have any fluids in it. All right, no worries. All right, take a look upstairs. Uh, we'll